Taylor Swift last week was so much fun, even though I still might have a little sand in my ear. That's okay. Today, we're going to find out where we're going to be going for this next week. since it's the capital of France. Paris is known for the beautiful Eiffel Tower and the Louvre, which is home to the Mona Lisa. Oh look, it's my flight. Let's go. Welcome to Paris. More specifically, Madame Eliane's Cafe. Come join me. Today, we are gonna be reading a story about a little girl who goes to a French school and her adventures. So as we wait for our waiter, why not we grab a piece of cheese, maybe a burger, a sweet peach. Oh look, monsieur, monsieur. Yes, madame. Can I have a cappuccino? Um, light cream. Yes. Do you want anything else? No, thank you. Okay, it will be here shortly. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's start the story. Today we are going to be reading Madeline by Ludwig Bemelmans. What a cool last name. In an old house in Paris that was covered with vines. Oh, look at all those vines. I wonder where they are. Live 12 little girls in two straight lines. In two straight lines, they broke their bread and brushed their teeth and went to bed. I hear that the schools where you sleep are called boarding schools. Must be cool sleeping at a school. They smiled at the good and frowned at the bad. And sometimes they were very sad. They left the house at half past nine in two straight lines in the rain or the shine the smallest one was madeline look she even has the smallest tape measurement she was not afraid of mice look she actually looks like she's having fun with the mice she loved the winter snow and ice. To the tiger in the zoo, Madeline just said, poo poo. And nobody knew so well how to frighten Miss Clavel. In the middle of the night, one night, Miss Clavel turned on her light and said, something is not right. Little Madeline sat in bed, cried and cried, her eyes were red. And soon, Dr. Cohn came. He rushed out to the phone and he dialed D-A-N-T-O-N-10-6. Nurse, he said, it's an appendix. Oh my Madame. God, look, I think our waiter has our drink. Madame, Madame, yes. here is your cappuccino. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now, back to the story. What's going to happen to Madeline? In the car with a red light, they drove out into the night. Madeline woke up two hours later in a room full of flowers. Wow, they must really love her to give her so many flowers. Madeline soon ate and drank. On her bed, there was a crank and a crack on the ceiling had a habit of sometimes looking like a rabbit. Oh, come on, look at that crack looking like a rabbit. Cracks aren't supposed to do that. One nice morning, Miss Clavel said, isn't this a fine day to visit Madeline? Tiptoeing with solemn faces, with some flowers and vases. Look, there's all the girls. Come to visit her. In they walked and said, ah, when they saw toys and candy and dollhouses from Papa. 
but the biggest surprise by far was their stomach was a scar. Oh no, she has a scar on her stomach. Poor Madeline. Goodbye, they said. We'll come again. And the little girls left into the rain. They went home and broke in their bread. They brushed their teeth and went to bed. In the middle of the night, Miss Clavel turned on the light and said, Something is not right. What do you think is not right? Maybe another appendix. <gasps> oh, no. And afraid of a disaster, Miss Clavel ran as fast and faster and said, Please, children, do tell me what is troubling you. All the little girls cried, Boo-hoo! We want to have our appendix out, too. Good night, little girls. Thank the Lord you are well. And now, go to sleep, said Miss Clavel. And she turned out the lights and closed the door. And that's all there is. There isn't any more. This is only one of the Madeline series. There are many more. There's like Madeline Cats in Rome and so many others. I highly recommend the series. It is really good. But now that we are in Paris, let's go to the Eiffel Tower or the Louvre. Let's go. Woo! Oh my God. That sounds so exciting. But first, can you please do the check? Of course. Thank oh. you very much. What is wow. Now, let's go to the Eiffel Tower. Thank you for coming, Madame.